guys, this is Lalalalalia. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to the ECQ Season 3. So, yun nga po, no, na-extend na naman po ang quarantine. So, meaning we have more time to spend here in our houses. And personally, sobrang bored ko na dito sa house. Bored in house, ano na dun? Bored in house, blah, 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 bored. Bored in house, blah, 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 bored. Bored in house, blah, 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 bored. So, Today, we will be doing aesthetic paintings from Pinterest. Sobrang fan ako ng mga tao sa Pinterest and I tried several DIYs and room decoration decoration? Room decoration ideas from Pinterest then And never ko pang natry itong mga aesthetic paintings, ganyan. So today, we will be doing that. And if you want to see how I do that, Let's proceed! So for the materials that we're going to use, I'm going to use kasi acrylic for this one. Kasi na-notice ko na most of the people are fan of acrylics and hindi oil paints. Pero dati, yung sa Bob Ross painting tutorial lang ginamit ko ay oil paints. Pero ngayon, you're going to use acrylic paints. So ang kailangan natin for the acrylic paints are this mixing plate. Of course, acrylic paints. And then, when you use acrylic paints, you use water then for you to brush your washes. Brush your washes. So, okay, mayroon tayong nalagyan ng water. And you will also be going to need this set of brushes na pang acrylic paints. Uh, what I have noticed sa mga aesthetic paintings is they have a very minimal color palette and that makes them look aesthetic. So, sa unang painting na gagawin natin ay mayroon lang siyang parang red tones. We're going to make a cactus as well. So, Meron tayong green paints here. <laughs> so as usual, we're going to start with the background. So for the first layer of the background, we are going to use this lightest color here. Um, para ma-mix tong paint na to, or color na to, I used a lot of white and then a little bit of this pink. Now that we're done with the first layer, we are going to do the second layer. This is a bit darker lang from this one. So I'm going to add a little bit of orange and then white to it. change colors you have to wash your brush this one dip, dip. and make sure na wala masyadong excess water in your brush kasi tutulo yan sa canvas mo kapag hinayaan mo yan aesthetic painting and open it up. So let's move on to the second painting. So moving on to our second painting, we're going to use again this canvas. Um, ibang canvas of course. And for this, medyo may figure na siya. So I think I'm gonna outline it first before I do the background and all of that. And ang tip ko lang is you're going to be needing a lot of white in every painting. So I suggest, pagbibili kayo ng white paints, 
yung malaki na yung bibili nyo. So, this is what we are using. Of course, tadukin na siya kasi ilang beses na ito nagamit. <laughs> Okay, so we're done with our second painting and we're going to move on with our third painting. Hey guys, so we're going to proceed with the third painting. This third painting is something similar to the two paintings that we did earlier. So diba, the first painting has something like mountain kind of thing here. So yun din yung gagawin natin dito. Pero of course, different color. Pero parang same color palette lang yung gagamitin. And then the second painting has a circle here. So ganun din yung gagawin natin dito. So parang it's a combination of the two painting that we did earlier na. with the layers. We're done with the layers. And honestly, sobrang haggard ko na. It's so hot. Grabe. And also, I don't have energy that much today compared to my other videos. So I don't eat that much. We're going to move on with the circle na naman dito. And then, after nun, background naman. I'm going to do it pink ulit. I love pink. Wow. <laughs> Ang pangit. Pero I 
know that it's so bad. The circle is so bad. <laughs> Medyo okay na siya for me. This only means that lahat tayo nagkakamali, okay? And very okay lang yung pagdating sa painting. Alam, may klase pala kami. Class, may online class pala kami. Recorded naman yun, so I'm just gonna review it later. Ayan, so we're done with the circle. Na pinahirapan tayo at nagkamali tayo dito sa part na to. Pero we're going to do the background na. It's going to be pink. Mm -hmm. So, ito ulit. Ang dumi ng palette ko, diba? And one thing na sinabi sa akin ng mom ko, when you're working with the edges, like dito, mapapansin nyo yung brush nyo nagda-dry siya. So, nagkakaroon ng mga parang uh, yung class na may nagsastart na. So, nagkakaroon ng mga hindi smooth lines. So, kailangan mo lang lagyan ng tubig. Okay. Yung brush mo. So, so mo sa tubig, top it off Ante lang. And then, you dip into your paints. Tapos, work in your edges. already and if you want to see it welcome to this mama month welcome to this mama mama welcome to this mama montage again Ryan little <laughs> this far in my video. So these are all of my products. Um, I think I did a bit well. Comment down below your thoughts about this because I don't really know how to play with my artworks all the time. And if you want to try this at home, feel free to search on Pinterest some references because that's what I do too. Tag me na din if I inspired you to do something artsy today. That will mean a lot to me. And as always, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you want to be part of my journey in life, please subscribe to my channel. And again, this has been Leah. Thank you for watching. Bye!